Well, boys, we're back with another video. We are just trucking through unkempt woods. I have... It took me a little bit of time to notice that with the skunks, because clearly Stinky is a skunk, there was... I, I kept seeing the same skunk kit over and over and over. And then I noticed here just... You know, southwest straight run out from the from the zone in there was a skunk doe and it was conning even these are conning blue I killed it started killing it I think I've killed it about seven eight times now sometimes it was even sometimes it was yellow but boys a skunk doe appears to be the placeholder for stinky so this is a sp three spawn camp it's not hard. What I do is punt skunk kit that way. They both come running. As soon as I punt it, I hit F8. It targets the doe. They both come running, uh, the unrooted one. I hit darkness, I hit effigy, and that's it. So the difference for this time around is I will punt it, feign death, let it clear. I'll punt that one, feign death, uh, effigy, and then I'll pull stinky. So not going to be hard um, that's the key to these is getting them solo getting them single because we just we cannot deal with with our healers being messed up still you know you can see this right here i mean that was spam healing after i just killed a placeholder um a one of the treants um there's just something wrong with them. I know for sure they're not critical healing, but I just I feel like something else is off too. So, uh, boys, let's get this process started. I will punt and feign death. And now I want to target the other kit. Once aggro clears, we'll hop up, punt it, and then we should be able to just tag Stinky and that'll be a solo pull. Um, in this area, there's no roamers. It's just clear. So, this is an easy camp. I've been doing it for just a, a little bit. On and off, people have showed up in the zone. So, I've been running a, a cycle of this placeholder here and then the treant and just going back and forth. It's been real easy. Just need this to clear. Paralysis is refreshed. I'll probably move a little bit over this direction. Here we go. Um, just so I can actually see the dang thing. Yeah. All right. So we'll let that clear out. I'm not going to hit effigy in the off chance that I aggro one of those kits with stinky just on the off chance i doubt it would happen i think they're far enough away but we'll just sit tight for just a hair longer and then we'll drop this uh this skunk and get a little bit closer to getting out of the unkept woods you know i got real lucky on that last kill and got this chest piece and then i also got the focus, which I assume is going to make an upgrade for the Type 18 dogs, so that'll be another, you know, couple thousand hit point upgrade or a couple hundred at least. But I realize as I'm looking at this, you know, I haven't looked up the recipe yet, but I don't have any um, gems, any any of the trade skill diamond drops or whatever they're called. All right, so if in the off chance that we get an ad, I'll be able to hit effigy. Let's get this going. Oh, yep, see, it was a good move. So now we're clear. Man, Siri, what the heck are you doing on top of that mall? All right. Wow, I'm on autopilot. I treated that like a 
uh, trash mall and cast disease first. Whoa. We're back on it now. So if you see this down here, um, I don't know, maybe it's not anymore. But uh, today's the fifth. Uh, live has the expansion. And we had a lot of visitors today and while live was down. It was nice to see some and talk to some people that I haven't heard from in a bit. I think you guys are really going to like this expansion. I know so far I have. Um, it's the challenge is keeping Java alive, but I'm all right with that. Wait a minute, what is it? Res uh, boys, I'm not thinking, I'm not thinking at all. Let's get Jobber back and start this back up. And okay, there's that extinction. We didn't really miss too much. Um, just the opportunity to use Degree for Blood. Okay, looks like we're not doing too bad. Eight zero, man, just not making much progress though. Wow, way behind on my dots. All right, there's the blink. Silent prep, and it has been long enough that I will be able to use intensity instead of having to burn a glyph. I mean, honestly, boys, I don't even have enough right now for a glyph. Just keep an eye on Jolly. When he gets to about 50, is when we have to pause things and throw on a heel, which is right about now. Let's get a heel. It should be a twin cast heel. Oh, that did some good. Nice. All right, I just saw it blink, so let's get it back up there for wounds. And I'm losing a lot of dots right now. And we'll get wounds back on. Blood. We've got double poisons, double fires. We gotta catch up. Looks like Big Pyre's blinking already. Come back over here. Both diseases are off. Man. Not, not my best burn. Not even a mill. It's alright. Just ran out of twin cast. Uh, looks like nine is off. Oh, I hit eight. Fat figure. Oh, okay. Well. Man. Just constantly watching him. Uh, we'll switch the blood. Should have done that at 40-ish. And heal. And looks like we need to start the process all over again. I'm missing one of the diseases. I think it's I think it's grip. Nope. It wasn't. Alright. Start it back up. Where are we at? 115 and change. Missing the poison. So let's get him back. Decent position. We're about to, about to go. Is that gonna sync up? It's not. So here's our second wounds. I looked like the resist. I didn't see it land. Where are we at? Oh, we're barely into that. <laughs> 
and it's grit. <sighs> Jobber. I mean, boys, it, I, I might be complaining a little, but it's, it, this is not impossible. One more. Um, it just takes a lot more focus on Jobber than it used to. Um, so, gosh, so don't get discouraged that your fights are going to take twice as long as they used to. Just keep Jobber alive. Just constantly keep your runes on them. And when the situation occurs, throw a heal out there. You know, I really hope that when the mercs get you know, patched up, we'll be in a better spot and kicking butt again, like we always do. And I probably should have put another. Oh, there we go. I probably should have put another wounds on. Heck, I probably have time for it. Man, he just dropped, what, 20-something percent in the course of not even two clicks? I mean... It's a challenge. See, this is where I know something, I've noticed as well, something is really up with our healer mercs. Not healing me at all. That's just my area effect heal that procs occasionally, and my leech, uh, where is this? My leech drain. Missing disease. Looks like we're. I'll just start fresh. Wrong one. All right, no big deal. So down to the last ten percent, wound should proc, and that should knock out a good five percent or so. I say that, and we're back on the healing wagon. Man, just like that, just drops. One more. <sighs> Looks like six, seven, eight, nine, zero, and the whole thing. Okay. Just fine on this. Three, four, five. And I will keep it going because even though it's 4%, it's still a long ways to go. I think we can call this a W. Keep him up a little longer. Real nice, man. Like getting spelt. It stinks. Okay. This is what happens when your uh, Slayer achievement gets erased on um, the test server, you know, back in 20, 
early 23. You just never bother to fix it, and you get random things like that. And I know I should. I know it's a big bump up in DPS, but it, it hurts. Anyway, boys, put Big Jobber away. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, um, don't need arms, so we'll leave those on the corpse. Like that. What do we got? Vusi's Crusher. It's a one-handed blunt with fire. And these ratios are insane. They're just insane. Well, not going to do any good. But if you boys are looking for upgrades, I mean, this is the kind of stuff that, I mean, I'm, I'm confident that's better than blood soaked. I'm really sure it is. So, anyway, boys, uh, enough of that. Um, again, the camp is right here on this tree. There's three spawns, two kits, and then a doe. Skunk doe is the placeholder for Stinky. Um, you saw how to get the single pull. That's all that matters. You know, you no roamers in this area of the woods. Um, I don't... There's nothing to it. Nothing to it. Keep Jobber up. That's the only thing you got to worry about. Other than that, it's proper mana management. You know, make sure that at about 40, I mean, if, if you're smart, you might even do it at 50%, hit Blood Magic. And when it gets to the third stage, Kaza, hit Death Bloom and you're fine. I don't even know. Did I hit Death Bloom? I probably did. But that's it, boys. Another one down. I am working on and i'm going to go check right now if um i believe i figured out korsh i think but i know for sure tender stump I, I i've just had bad luck but i know for sure tender stump is in this area there are three different kind of treants there are uh the ones that that are the higher level so i assume their placeholders are planters and there's one in here that I just kill it, I come back and kill another. I'll go over here and kill some stuff. But that's where I'm heading to next. I have no idea what this is. The only thing I can think of, the only creatures left that I haven't killed, is I don't think we're supposed to kill Eldars. There are uh, Basilics, Balsics, Basilics, how I think you pronounce. Just around this area, this is elevated, this is like a, it's not a plateau, but kind of. There are multiple spawns around here of those little lizard creatures. Uh, a lot of them are like, I think hatchlings or something where they're, they're super easy cones, but there are some that are not, that are, uh, that are blue. That might be the, the last family of mobs that you gotta take out. I don't know what Oka means, but maybe it's some sort of lizard. I don't know, boys. Anyway, uh, that's it for this camp. I hope this video helps you guys with your hunter in the unkempt woods. And I'll see you boys in the next video.